Hi friends, in this tutorial we are going to learn about the creation of a design table. So right now I'm in the path workbench. So I'm going to create a path now. So selecting the center rect rectangle. Double click. This will be the height will be 100. And uh, length will be 200. Exit workbench, pad will be 20 mm. I'm going to place a hole on this surface, positioning the sketch. This will be 20, and uh, same. The height will be will be also same, 20 mm. So fix it. The diameter of the hole will be 20 mm. Depth will be 20 mm. now the hole is made and uh, we are going to place a rectangle pattern uh, i'm going to object pattern this hole reference element will be the surface reverse direction phi instantaneous and uh, distance from the hole from center to center will be 40 mm preview so second direction instantaneous will be 3 and the spacing will be 30 mm from center to center okay so in this way we have created a part with some features so now we are going to apply design table for this so a knowledge toolbar you will be having a design table select this there are two options create a design table from pre-existing file create a design table with current parameters value select the second option click ok so after clicking OK, select parameters to insert dialog box appears. So here there are n number of uh, values and parameters. Each and everything will be considered in our part that we have made. So now we are going to filter this. There are uh, renamed parameters, hidden parameters, visible parameters. So on length, everything will be considered. So if you click on the length parameters it will be filtering only the length parameters so clicking on the length option so now select the length part body length sketch one length uh, if you select that one yeah, the, the length will be appears click the arrow and uh, sec select the second one same process now pad distance we have given 20 mm click the arrow next the second limit we have not given anything so it doesn't make now we have given the diameter of the hole 20 mm and depth will be 20 mm offset distance 20 same next and spacing between the center to center of the hole will be 40 mm same center to center of the hole in what in vertical direction it will be 30 mm so in this way you can uh, insert the parameters so if you rename these parameters you can click on the rename it parameters and you can select the parameters so click ok then uh, it is asking to save the file i'm going to save on the desktop yes So it changes into the red color. Don't be any kind of. Now we are going. If you want to place a new values in this, uh, just go to the edit table. Change the values 200. And the value of this will be 200. Pad will be 40 mm and uh, holder will be 20 mm depth of the hole will be 40 mm this will be 25 spare edge distance and uh, in this way you can change values if you want you can write many more and uh, be sure that you are saving this file save this exit 
then automatically it synchronize the design table closes and uh, there are two options now select first option then it will be okay then select the second option okay then these are the values which we have given second time so in this way you can create a design table if you have any doubts you can comment on this video i will be in touch with you hope you like this video thanks for watching have a nice day bye